Hey guys, how are you? I get to talk about mega trends, such an important subject because how can you plan and look moving forward with the information that you have now and what's happening around you now? You're already behind the time, so how can you make those sorts of those forms of decisions and how you're going to have an impact moving forward? So it's really important that we understand some of these top level trends that are happening in the world because they always impact. It's like a domino effect. It really does happen. It's like, let's, here's a for instance, 20 years ago, they were talking about one of the safest jobs that you could actually have in the world at that time was working inside a bank. That is no longer the case because of the internet, internet banking, how many banks have closed around you in, in, the, in the cities, and the CBDs, internet banking companies have risen, actual banks that you can walk into have reduced, their hours are reducing, the amount of workers that are inside there has reduced considerably. This was a mega trend that was talked about 10 to 15 years before that it's going to be a challenge for people working in the banking sector. You know, when my mum and dad grew up, if you actually went and you got a degree, you would be in a job for life. That was seen as a job for life. So your 30, 40 year career, it was seen as a job for life. No longer. Things are moving that quick now because of technology. The actual time that these things happen is compressed. So the changes that happen are all compressed. So it's really important that we start to get that in our psyche. So the job that you're doing right now is going to be challenged. Let me give you some examples of some of the mega trends. If you're currently a teacher, if you're currently a teacher, I already know the places in CSU are, have actually set up and have the capability and are using hologram technology to be able to beam an actual specialist in a subject from a university, university lecturer, a specialist a scientist into the classroom to be able to deliver actual content. The sizes of our universities have, have gone from huge, these huge big ones that, we, that we've seen in, inherently for years down into something that's a lot more smaller because you're able to online study in your own time on your demand, your choice. So, you know, if you're looking at those sorts of things and you're looking at, you know, teachers, doctors, nurses, I mean, look at the way that they're doing things at the moment. They can actually do, they can actually perform surgery from the UK on somebody's body in the States via technology. Already happening. Look at our taxi drivers, look at Uber, look at our hotels, look at, um, look at Airbnb. Look, just start to look at things like that. So when I talk about mega trends, it's so important. Excuse me, I've got a bit of a sniffle. That we, it's so important that we look at what's happening, what's happened, what's happening right now, and what's moving forward. So when we speak to people and we talk about what we're doing within Lavelle, we are spearheading the U economy spearheading the EU economy. This is cloud-based. Nobody else has got this leading nutritional technology. You know, we are, we are leading the way that we are the only business with DFT, Dermafusion technology. We are utilizing this and we are working from our phones, from our laptops, wherever we want to work. No, gone, nearly gone is the nine to five job. You can work wherever you want. It's going to be the norm in the next few years. Let's even look at it this way. Five years ago, uh, we started our business and we were told um, we were told that we needed shop frontage. And we said, no, we don't. We don't need shop frontage to be able to perform a business. And we're an, an award winning business. And you and we were scoffed at because of that. But now look at the trend. How many businesses are actually um, getting together and collaborating to cut down that cost because they don't have to have that shop frontage anymore because people aren't searching that way. Have a look at how the newspapers are working, how TV is working, look at the rise of YouTube, look at the rise of Netflix, look at the demise of a lot of the other businesses like Blockbusters, Kodak. Blah, blah, blah. I mean, it really is about relevancy. We are totally, completely and utterly relevant right now and the moving forward for the next few years. That's why when you see Lavelle up in their game a little bit, that's to stay ahead of the curve. And it's really important that we understand this. So the roles that are out there at the moment are going to change. The kids who are in school at the moment are looking at work where we did years ago where, you know, I want to be a doctor, a dentist, a lawyer, uh, a carpenter, a plumber, da, da, da. all of these things are sort of still going to be there. 
But when you think about a house can now be built by a 3D printer, think about it. Think about all the people that it takes to build a house. Think about you can now actually get a house on the back of a flatbed, place it onto a slab, and it automatically starts to open up and your house is built in five hours. You know, this is coming and this is gonna be the norm. This is why mega trends are so massively important to us all. And just understand guys, that we are at the forefront of it right now. So the EU economy is huge. 76 million people are anticipated to join in the next five years. What are you gonna do with that information? Are you gonna sit there as we've done in the past and let that just pass us by? Or are we gonna actively work and actively get involved to make sure that, that we're at the, at the spearhead of all of that, that we're right at the front of all of that? The choice is yours. And it's, it's just wide open right now. It's just an exciting time to be alive. It's an exciting time to be involved. And we are so stoked to be able to, involve, to be involved with this with you guys. Again, megatrends are massively important. They drive the future. It's how you're going to be working. And it's definitely how your kids are going to be working. And it's definitely how your kids' kids are going to be working. What are you going to show your kids? Anyway. I'll leave that with you. Hope that helped. Some nice little snippets when people come to you and they say, what on earth are you doing? Why are you doing that for? But you, can, you can now hopefully have a little bit more information to go out there and tell them. Anyway, thanks for watching. Speak soon.